The Otto Sinkless is one of the best algae eating fish that I have ever had. This little dude has cleaned this entire aquarium. You will notice that the plants here, the Nubius, were, it was caked with black algae a lot worse than this java fern over here. This java fern is getting cleaned as well but this java fern had algae all over it. Uh, this, the glass in front, there's still a few spots but it had algae all in front of it too. Look at that autosynchronous. He's just going to town. He's not eating that plant. He's just sucking that algae off of it and he goes through each of these plants he really did the very first day he knocked out that that plant and he's just cruising around looking for algae to eat the black algae is particularly you know the dark brown stuff is is what he took care of the most the uh other algae eaters in here i've got a bristlenose placo he's done a real good job on the front of this tank on this glass uh, sides in the back uh, he's fantastic and I get I think a lot of these ghost shrimp here you see one there um, they're doing a good job on this hair algae like that but mostly it's this uh, there's the bristle nose right there baby bristle nose he's out here just uh, sucking away doing a good job on, on all this stuff too so but but the highlight of the day the highlight of this video it the the best algae eater i've seen is this autosynchronous catfish he's just non-stop worker uh thoroughly cleans everything he he goes for goes in between the cracks and crevices i uh, just got to uh if you have I mean, I'll show you some of the video before. Um, if you want to take a look, I might link it up or just uh, do the part, look at the part one. And you'll notice that this tank was horribly uh, caked. It was horribly uh, overrun with the hair algae, which, look at that. The hair algae is gone from these plants there's a little bit left there a little bit there for him to eat but he is doing such a great job the black algae like I said before BAM and on this plant he's gotten everything there's a little bit left on the tips but it looks so clean on these plants here this plant back there is, is now starting to grow back again I mean, it's just in the snails too. The snails are doing a great job back there, but uh, highlighting the autosynclus. There's another mystery snail back there. But um, the combination of the, and there's the bristle nose doing his thing too. Uh, the combination of the autosynclus, the bristle nose placo, the snails, and the. Um, the ghost shrimp, the ghost shrimp are cheap too, so they're, they're meant for feeders, but uh, they do a good job cleaning up some of this algae. But uh, the winner, winner of the chicken dinner is definitely that Otto Sinkless. He is just amazing. And um, once this tank gets cleaned up completely, I mean, I, I, I didn't even scrape the glass or anything like that. And you guys saw how, how really overrun this tank was. But uh, I've got to give him props. So autosynclus, if you don't have one and you have a lot of algae, you got an algae problem, I would definitely recommend the autosynclus. Anyway, this is uh, tropicalfishguy.com. Uh, <clears throat> happy fish keeping. Please leave a comment, subscribe to the channel, give me a like, a thumbs up, uh, wherever you're watching this at. Uh, pass this along to anybody who needs algae cleaned in their tank. And let me know uh, what you use to clean your algae. Um, thanks a lot for watching. I really appreciate you guys. Happy fish keeping. Peace out.